Chat, we're gonna have a dev come. Dev's gonna come show us stuff with the game. Okay, so this is what they have so far. Yasuo, Elawi, Echo, Darius, Braum, and Ari. I wanna play Braum. Braum, they just announced Braum. Hey, how's it going? I'm Sean, nice to meet you. I'm the game director. I think you met me like briefly last year at yes. Evo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thanks so much for visiting us though. Of course, dude, I'm super excited about this. Dude, I would love to show you like yeah. the Braum and anything else. Yeah, hell yeah. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm down. Here, let me, let me back out of this. You want me to set up a training mode so we don't have to worry about killing each other? We can just like mess around and hit buttons. Okay, okay. Is that cool? So you're a big fan, man. Okay. Yeah, yeah, thanks, dude. All right, okay. tell me who you want to run, and I'll show you. Can okay. Can give you a rundown of kind of what they're about, or have you played a little bit? Okay, so I've I've played a little bit. Okay. Like uh, last year, and then, and then uh, yeah, whenever we came by a couple months ago. But um, I'm, who I like the most, I liked Ari, okay. and I like Darius. Oh, hell yeah. Uh, I want to see Braum. Braum okay, yeah. Let's uh, let's start with Ari, because actually Ari's changed a lot. We actually changed her and made her easier to use. Oh, really? So I'd okay. love to show you that, and especially get your thoughts since you played the older one. Yeah. Let's see if we're hitting the mark or not. Okay. Let me show you a little bit with Braum, right? Okay, so, okay. So, like, you know, you got your light, medium, and heavy. Okay. But so, so Braum's got big Yeah, oh, and you can you hold do. it, yeah. You can also hold forward and heavy. So if you hold towards me, you do a big ass baseball swing. Okay. Try that. And you can, Brom's heavies, you can hit them twice usually, but we're in full, so you can't. Okay. It does like a bunch of stuff. So go ahead and try to just mash lights. Oh, mash lights. I'll show you the full stuff. Okay. Just mash light. Just mash so, this button over and over again. Oh, what the heck? So it just shows you, like, hey, this is how Brom does an air combo. So you can kind of get an idea. The people can just jump into the bun. So now mash medium. And, you'll, and if you have the bar, you'll go right into the super. Really? Okay. So you can just get to the fun right away. So mash heavy to try to What the frick? Take them, take them there. Uh oh, it's snack time? Throw the snacks. <laughs> Yeah, that's like, such that's a good, a that's such a good super, oh actually. God. That's so funny. So, so that's kind of what Pulse is about, right? Okay. Yeah, we got the push-up. Oh, the push-up, oh, nice. The bench press. Yeah. That's so good. After you do that, you can hold S2. Okay. So hold this one after you do that, the push-ups. Oh, I'm that's doing it. That's oh, there you go. Oh. So if you just hold this button, he does a big, big, like, shield smash. Yeah. And it eats projectiles, so they can't okay. keep you away. So if I'm like, Ari, right, start holding, do hold S2. Yeah, so it's, it's, like, it's like a super armor? Oh, wait. Yeah, so hold back S2. Oh, I tried that. Hold back, yeah. Like, and then you, while you're doing that, you can call the assist to hit me. So you can do, like, 14. Uh. And then I just get rocked. You know what I'm saying? Right. And then when you're playing with a friend, it's actually super fun. Like, yo, I got you, I got you. And you're blocking and everything. Brom seems broken. <laughs> he definitely seems broken. I'll show you. He's kind of slow, right? Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Away, like, these things are slow. Yeah, I get that. And, like, the, so he, we gave him a tool that people are running away, which is forward S1. Okay. So hold forward and hit S1. You can throw a 4-0. Okay. And you're like, that doesn't really do anything, but it kind of locks you up, and then Ari's coming, and yeah. so, like, it's just enough to stop him, you know? Yeah. And it's also cute as hell. And you, yeah, can, the you, can start, you can just do a normal throw, or you can hold it. You have to, you have to wait for him to leave. That's the cooldown. And then you can do a big throw. So it's actually just, like, something to kind of keep him, like, from jumping in the air all over. Brom, yeah, it's, you know? that's your anti-air, okay. Yeah. And then, uh, then Braum has a, you want to get an unbreakable, so hit S2 twice. Keep mashing. So once you hit that, you go into unbreakable. When you're in this, like if you hit S2 twice again, oh. you'll use the ice to give you to the corner, and then you lost it, right? Right. So you hit S2 twice, and then you get the ice on your shield. That's yeah. the unbreakable. And so what this does actually is like your uh, your like medium attack and your heavy attacks all have to hit an armor. Okay. So just try to hit me. Just hit heavy. Try again. So, like, it's really scary when he's got that. I don't want to swing into you, you know? So how do I counter it? So you can throw him, and if you throw him, then he gets knocked down and loses the, the unbreakable. The loses okay. The ice. So you can also uh, do a charge heavy. So if you charge it up, hit him. Okay. Anything that knocks him down. So, like,
like uh, I'll show you. So, so I have unbreakable fish, throw me, hit these two buttons. Yeah, you knock me down too, and that, that makes it go. Oh, okay. Knock them down, throw them. Okay. Oh, see like the, the block and then Ari came out? Yeah, that's sick. So like, if I go in and I'm like, I'm hitting, I'm hitting, whatever, right? Yeah. And then I go back. Yeah, if I try to hit that, then I get just like think, and then I get rocked, right? Right. So you got to be real careful. We really wanted to put like a defensive character on the team. Yeah, it like, makes sense. You're playing with someone, right? Like, it's like, oh, no, I'm going to save you. It's just like such a cool moment. Now it's my turn to you, right? Right. Let me show you a little bit of Ari, too. Okay. Oops. Actually, we'll show you more problems. We'll show you more problems. Okay. Let's, uh, let's, uh, let's see if we can do, like, a, a, a manual combo. Okay. So do, uh, so, you know, like, let's see if we can do light, medium, heavy. Can you try that? Light, medium, okay. heavy. Okay. Then after that, yeah, light, medium, heavy, and then do the, the, the down, heavy, down, heavy. Blocking. What's up? Hit me again. Oh, I swear I was like automatically blocking. Uh, yeah, so you were actually doing a retreating card. So hold back, and then while you're holding back, hit the dash button. So hold back and hit this. Sorry. Wait till you block. Until you start blocking. See how you're you're like glowing? Start attacking me. See how. Oh. Like it's like a disengage. So while you're blocking, yeah, it's a disengage, but the problem is you're weak to lows. So if someone does this, they can hit you. So you, can't, you can't overly abuse it, but it's really good like in a game where like you have Ari attacking and I'm attacking, you know? That's really fun. So we're going to we're gonna, we're gonna learn a combo. I want you to learn a Okay, okay. So I want you to do light, medium, heavy, forward heavy. Just try that. Light, medium, heavy, forward heavy. Yeah. That's it. So after the light, medium, heavy, forward heavy, do down heavy twice. Do that. Okay. Boom, light, boom, boom, heavy, boom. Forward heavy, boom. down heavy twice. Oh, wait. Oops, I did that wrong. So light, medium, heavy, forward heavy, heavy, down heavy. Down, down. And then after that second one, then you're going to hold that, that, that S2. So it'll look like this. Okay. There you go. Okay. So it's kind of like, there you go. There you go. Is there like any downside of like, because if I can just go and hit like one button the whole time without having to do anything, like, is that not too, uh, like, like, is that too easy, you think? It's a great question. The way we look at it is kind of two One, uh, the pulse combos are good combos, but they're not the best combos. So, right. so at some point, it's not enough, right? Like, people will do more damage than you because they're doing, like, a slightly better thing. The other thing, too, the more important thing is, when you use pulse, you're giving up a different fuse. So these other fuses let you do those combos that you could do them manually, but then you can call your assist twice. Or you can get more damage when you get low on health. So you're giving up, basically, another fuse to use. That's the real weakness. But that weakness doesn't really matter. Saying. So it's like it's almost like a it's almost like a modern in Street Fighter where you exactly, do less damage, exactly. but but it's exactly. yeah. like and like for us we're like hey we're we, we kind of bring it like this is the default way to play and if people don't ever switch off the ball and they're having a good time then hell yeah yeah you know? it works okay but, but like if you and I are playing on a team and say like I'm brand new and you're a veteran and you're like hey man normally when you bring me into a fighting game you have to beat the hell out of me and that's not really fun and that's uh -huh. why we made it a team game. But in this case, it's like, hey, uh, you're like, let's just pick pulse. And I'm doing pulse combos, but you can still do these hard combos that you practice, right, when we're playing together. Right. That's, that's kind of the thing that we're excited about. Okay. Cool. It's hard, you know, you know in all these competitive games, it's hard to bring someone in and have them teach them competitively. Either they're going to run away or you're going to beat the hell out of them. It's like, right. hey, let's play on the same team, right? And just 
enjoy it together. That makes sense. So, so something I'm noticing, and maybe I'm remembering, like misremembering, but did her did her balls automatically charge before or no? They, they didn't. So okay. So let's let's like let's that's a great segue. So uh, Ari, she used to be a character that she could shoot a or shoot a ball, yeah. and then you had to manually recharge it. Yeah. And we got a lot of feedback then from people that were like, yo. Uh, that used to explode. Now it shoots a delay shot. Yeah. Uh, people are like, yo, she's really fun, but I can't play this, and I don't have fun charging up and running away. Yeah. That I, play pattern wasn't fun, but people are like, I love how she looks, and I want to play her. So we're like, we hear you. Let's make it a little bit easier to find the fun. So let me show you what we did. Okay. So in the air, you can jump, and you can shoot one. If you know, she just loses everything. But when she lands, they all come back automatically. So there's no more manual recharging. They just come back. Yeah, it's a lot better. It's really simple, right? You can shoot it down as well. Well, it takes a second. Uh, and then, like, check this out on the ground. Just hit it three times. Just, uh, oh, don't don't crouch. Just, uh, just hit S1 three times. That's not full speed. That's just Ari. That's just what she does. But if you hit, uh, if you do it twice and it hits a dash button, you can do stuff like this. Oh. So oh, I screwed up. One. So go one, two. And then I can yeah, combo into go. something else. There you go. Yo, yo, right. that's what's up. Okay. Right away? I see what you're saying. Okay. So, uh, so we, we kind of like this, and then she can actually fake it. So oh, you can, like, okay. Hold the button. If you hold the second button, then she'll just do nothing. It has to hit though. So you go, you go, like second one is in S1, S2, or S1, S1. It's the second. Uh, if you hold down. So you hit S1 and hold down at S1. And S1's oh, down S1. it's like a fake out. Okay. Yeah. And it's, it's, it's slow, but like it's, it's really good when you have an assist coming out. And then, uh, yeah, that's cheap. So let me show you about this bomb. This bomb used to use all of our orbs and explode, and it wasn't really useful. And now we kind of like have heard from people that are like, hey, I wish I could leave a, we're calling it a parting gift, something that I can leave and bring my new character in. So check this out, right? So if I do this, okay. and I think you're already starting to do it. Yeah. yeah. So it's like if I do something like this, Okay. You have to worry about it. It's coming. Right? So, so, and then now I'm on the other side, and it, it essentially works as a mix-up. So I, I'm blocking here. I'm going to hit from behind, and then it opens me up. Yeah, you can open you up, and also it's like full screen. If I do like something like this, it'll forget about it, you know, and then it, it'll hit you. Like, you oh, hit you, but yeah. it breaks kind of. And so it lets you be really tricky, and also it holds in. So just do it. Do down as one. If I jump, it'll come up after you, right? So it's, we just added just hey, a little bit more depth, crunchiness. So yeah, that's kind of like, uh, that's really all it looks like with her. That's the major changes. Just, yeah, let's make this part fun. Let's, uh, let's make no more like, no more like huge ammo system you have to deal with. Yeah, I think, I think that was a good change. So that was my big problem with Ari, too. Thank you so much. Yeah. Actually, I think I remember you saying something similar where you were like, this is cool, but it's a little hard, it's a little hard, right? And I'm like... Yeah, it's just because it was like, I, I had to do like resource management. It's like, it's one thing already because like you have like your meter and everything. Already, but then right? but then one more, is, it's just like uh, having like a passive like recharge is cool, I think. Oh yeah. Like I'll show you what an advanced combo looks like with her. Just to give okay. So you can do something like this. Like big, big ramen, like you know, stuff like that. Right. So you can kind of like, you can use tank launcher in the middle of the combo. Or like already can do stuff like this too, which is pretty cool. Like stuff like, okay. stuff like this. Then air dash. Stuff like that. I messed it up, but you get the idea. Yeah. So you go, so you're doing lights and then you're swapping to medium in there? Or? Yeah, in the air, I literally just do like, S2. So oh, it's this thing. Two. Okay. So just jump and try it. Yeah, after you do that heavy, you can literally just tap S2. So do the lights, and then do S2. Oh, that's going too. I didn't know you could do that. Uh, I'll do something like this. Like, let me see if I can do it. Okay. I messed up. I messed up. Okay. So we're going lights, S2. Yeah. Until I see this move, this heavy, then I'll switch. I'll switch to S2. Okay. One, two, three, and then S2. Ah, oh, okay. So, right here. There? No, I'm, I'm, I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm doing it early. One, two, three. Now. Now. Am I doing it late or early? 
I think you're hitting light too many times. Okay, all right. So. So light, light, light. That's a little early. That's a little early. There you go. It would be after that big hit. Frick. That's the best. Yeah, that's the one. Wait, you know what? I think I, I'm hitting a directional. I think that's why. Oh, yeah. Sorry, I didn't tell you. It's just, it's just not, no direction. Yeah, there you go. And so if you're high enough up, you can, you can shoot an orb down after. You have to be pretty high in the air. But you can kind of see how, like, oh, I got the pulse layer. Then I'm going to switch midway through the pulse to start trying other things, right? Right, that's, right. That's, that's really what we're going for, right? Like, hey, I can start to try other things whenever I want. And I then, see what you're saying. Yeah, so, like, it, it's a more natural... It, it, it's an easier, it's like training wheels. It, to, yeah. to, get, to get somebody into it, it like eases them into the actual yeah. like rhythm of the game. And then the, as you like build up that confidence, it's like, wait, I'll try something else like when I'm in the air. And then you start like slowly developing the muscle memory. Okay. That's cool. Yeah, it's, it's, again, it's all like very new. So like, you know, if you're messing with it, if you, if you try to teach someone the game and you're like, oh, yo, it could be way better if you did X, Y, or Z, like, let us know. You know, we're, yeah. we're always trying to improve it and listen to feedback. Like, like, oh. Yeah, because I remember, like, like I had to practice her launcher combo last year. Yeah, it is it's really hard. <laughs> is, that, is, that, is it still the same? Is the launcher combo itself still the same? It's pretty similar. I'll, let me see if I can try it. So it's just like, launch, one, two, three. And then that does work, it's different. You're like, okay. And now, does it, does it do more damage if you do the manual inputs? Oh, it does No, and that's because we're like, hey, like, After that, you can do down, down, S2. Down, S2? Yeah. When you hit the super, it will give you unbreakable on hit. And if oh. you have unbreakable, it will shatter and use it. That one's really cool. Do that one from the side. Down, down, S1. Oh, oh that's sick. From League, you know? Like, yeah. that's the, the ult. Yeah, it's sick. You had to give a homage, you know? No, I think that's one of the cool things is like for, for a lot of people that say they're let's say they're not even like interested or they're new to fighting games completely. If they're league players, they want to see those things. Like it's like, oh yeah, like I don't know, I'm just example. <laughs> uh, like Draven, let's say let's say you had Draven, right? It's like okay, you're playing with Draven, like they want to have something where they catch the uh, or where they, the they axe, catch the axes. Right? Or like something that they throw the axes and it comes back. Like, oh yeah, the stuff big, like, like the all. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's the kind of stuff people like seeing. It's really hard. Like, I'll just be really candid with you. It's hard because, like, the things that, like, like Ari's oh, known no. for charm and lead. Yeah. But you notice that's on our ult. Yeah. And uh, we've got a question, like, why isn't this a normal move in the game? It's because League has a lot of CC. <laughs> and so we have to, like, how do we how do we still pay the player that loves yeah. League, but also make it a fun to watch and play? Like, Ari's design, I think you did the right way. Oh, thank like, you. Like, is like, uh, what was like, what is she? She's like, a, she's a fox. So it's yeah. like, she, she like, she scratches and claws, like, fast, fast character. Like, it makes sense. Chad keeps asking about this, too. He's like, well, how are they going to, like, do you think they'll have Kale? And I'm like, well, I don't know what they would do with Kale. Like, if you guys had, listen, hypothetically, right? Like, because yeah. Kale's range, like, her whole thing is, like, she gains range over time. Yeah. But, like, how do you really do that? In a, I don't know. Let me make this crystal clear for everybody listening. Okay. No champion is off the table. No and champion is off the no table. No champion off the table. I have the utmost faith in our team to be able to make a sick as hell champ in a fighting game. Okay. So if okay. you or anybody else wants to see a champ in our game, let us know. Okay. You know, the problem, the really problem is like there's so many champs in league. Yeah. And, you know, we can only put so many in at the start and yeah. over time. So everybody's like, I can't believe you didn't put X, Y, or Z in the game. And I'm like, you know, I know, I know. Like there's so many champs that everybody yeah. loves, right? So, I mean that. Like the game has like 130 or something now. It's, yeah, it's, like, it's, yeah it's, I mean, it's a huge, I think it's like 160 plus at this point. Yeah, it's, it's crazy. It's a lot. That's a better way of looking at it. Is well, League has four abilities. The fighting game is the more actual, like, like the fighting game for 2XKO is more like that's the more well-rounded, like what the character actually can do. Like, exactly. if if you were to imagine like there were just somebody walking around or something, that makes sense. But in yeah. League, they only have four abilities. Yeah. I, mean, I think I think that's a good way of looking at it. Yeah, like. Uh, 
for me personally, like, yeah. dude, the league is so inspiring, and I'm like, they've given us so much awesome material and been yeah. such amazing, like, folks. I, I just, I'm so happy we're making it in this IP, you know? Yeah, it makes sense. Let's go back to, like, uh, let's go back to the character select. Yeah, sure. How can you acquire champions once you have the game? Do you have to buy them or acquire them? Well, I'm sure, like, I mean, you guys are, are probably way too far out to have that, like, finalized yet. Yeah, do we have yeah. that final answer? All I can say is, like, well, we definitely want to do things the right way. You know, right. Where, hey, like, we want our games free to play. You yeah. Know, we want you to be able to, like, earn and get those champions pretty easily. Uh, and then, hey, like, you know, there'll be cosmetics. You know, yeah. if you really, like, love what we're doing and you want to support us, like, it's, it's the typical, right, like, way to do it. And that's, that's what we're uh, aiming towards. Nice. Okay. But you, I can show you anybody else you want to see. Um, has Darius changed at all? Oh, we got, yeah, we got a, a couple things and then I'll show you. Okay. Yeah, so I think I also noticed you have more, do you have more fuses other than Pulse? Yeah, absolutely. So we had four before and Pulse is our fifth one that we added. Oh, okay. So I, just, I thought like, there was three for some reason. Yeah, so it's like 2x, you can call your partner twice when they're off screen and then there's a longer cooldown, so you have to wait longer, that's the trade off. Uh, double down, you can, you can do like your super and then your partner can come immediately and combo their super ult. So if you can get a bunch of meter, it can be like really explosive. Uh, freestyle, this one's a little bit harder one. It's like, hey, your partner comes in, you switch, and then you can switch again back. So like you can actually create some really gross mix ups. Like oh, attacking, yeah. Now I'm attacking, now I'm attacking, you know? But okay. it's, uh, it takes a little bit of time. And Fury is, it used to be our recommended one. It's still, we still think it's pretty good where, hey, if you don't want to think super hard, like when I'm below 40% health, I just do more damage. Right. For the right until my character dies that round. But there's a little bit of crunchiness where you can dash cancel. When you right. dash cancel, like you'll do even more damage for like six seconds. So okay. There's a little bit of discovery there, but it's it's the one like, hey, I just want to do more damage if I get low on health. I don't want to have to do a bunch of extra so like, switching. You get 40% damage bonus after the after the dash cancel? Uh, it's so it's it's uh, below 40% get a bonus damage for the rest of the round. That's just on. Right. And if you do a dash cancel, I think you get uh, like 20% additional on top of that. I forgot the base. Uh, okay. Damage, but it's it's pretty substantial. Like when someone's right. in that state, you got to be careful. Okay. But yeah. But it happens, it all happens below 40%? Below 40%. There's okay. like a, a little like indicator and you'll see like it's turned on and there's a little icon. And, but okay. yeah, so the risk is like, hey, if your character you know, they get you to ride above 40% and then they kill you. You don't get to use it. Right. The, the benefit is like something like 2x. Oops. If one of my characters dies, it doesn't matter that I can call him twice because I can't use it anymore. Right? Yeah. Versus Fury, you can Same use it. Same with double down. Exactly. So again, it's uh, we wanted to make these decisions interesting and it really changes yeah. how you play. Yeah. Yeah, actually, now that you think about it, it's like two times assist, double down, and freestyle are all based on having two people up. Yep. And the so, cool thing is, like, we're playing the same team, but if you go 2x and I go freestyle, what you're going to see us doing is probably way different. And so, like, yeah. it's more player expression, more discoverable depth, you know, and just more to dig into, honestly. Right. But yeah, and that's, we're pretty excited. This is just the, the beginning. And, you know, we can change these easily and, and update them based on player feedback and data and sentiment. We can add new ones, we can pull ones out. You know, you can imagine, like, what if there's a world where during a season there's, like, a limited time point? You right. Know, that makes the season feel different, right? Right. Um, and we haven't committed to anything like that. Yeah, but, but it's just, like, it's just, just yeah, yeah, just, like, brainstorming ideas. No, yeah. it's interesting. Oh. Yeah, I wonder. Well, the good thing with Riot is, like, just in general, like, this is, like, a company-wide thing that you guys do is, like, you guys move pretty quick. Like when, okay. yeah, like whenever, whenever, Welcome back, everyone. like, hey, it's ready, it's ready, okay. But now it's like, if we need to change something, you guys just kind of change stuff, which is like, I think that's good. I wish more companies would do that. More people have started doing it, but like, I feel like Riot was always one of those that was like really good about it. It was like, oh, okay, this is weird, let's change it. Yeah, and just see what happens. Ari's a great example, right? Yeah. yeah. It's like, or the Pulse games. So, like, we're, we're going to be this game that's, that's around forever. That's what yeah. we want to be like a forever fighting game. So how we do that is we listen to feedback, look at the data, see what the players think. Yeah, let's make a change. You know, yeah. like, why not? Why would yeah. we want to make it better? I'm oh, sorry. 100%. Well, let's do double down. I didn't know what to do. Big double? Yeah. <laughs> double down? All right. Let's do it again for us. One more time. Play play play. Play. Hold the microphone higher. There you go. Uh, let's do this. I think this is a new okay, one. Perfect. This is a new one. Yeah, I thought, I thought so. It's called, it's called Scuttler Strand. It's a. You know, Alawi, based on Alawi. Okay. Uh, yeah, this one we just, uh, we just dropped. Just a little surprise for chat. Maybe once you figure out what night you're on. Okay. As 
tonight is drawing, I'm going to be asking Kate about what it's like to work at Tokyo right. in the art department. But let's go ahead and okay. get started. All right. All right, let me show you some various stuff. So, okay. So we're not in bolts, right? So you gotta do the stuff through, through, right? Okay. So, uh, just like before, Darius has light, medium, yes, heavy, like most characters what, can do that. And then you can do S2, S2. Yeah. So, when you hit with that S2, S2, just go ahead and hit me with it. You notice how the tip kind of blows a little bit on yeah. the second one? Just like in league. Yep. Yeah, so it's max range. Yeah, so like the ship, you know? There you go. And so like now that I have it, like go ahead and switch to Ari. Now now I'm starting attacking. See, I still have it. So well also Ari. hit me. And it goes away. Oh, yeah, it goes away. Okay. Yeah, it's yeah, good guy. Yeah, it's like I was like, this is over. Bring him in again. <laughs> and so that's like that's one thing. And yeah, Darius has a nice book assist that he can do, which is really good. Like back in team. So if you hold back and hit team. And then you can either switch to him and keep it going or keep going with Ari. And it pulls you even if you're blocking. Can we just start? Oh, nice. Okay. So you can do, if you try S1, the hook, <laughs> you can do three things. You can do light or medium or heavy afterwards. So that's an unbreakable throw. Okay. And after, so after that, you down, down S1. So kind of. Yeah, do that. So we oh. Okay. And the throw. So hook, down, throw. Down, down, you can mash it. Oh, oh I didn't do it fast enough. Okay. You can just mash. There you go. And so like that's scary. And I'm like, how the hell do I get out after the whack? Well, jump, right? But if I jump, you can do light after the hook. So do hook in the light. That's one and then hit L. That hits me crouching, and if I try to jump, it hits me. You can follow up with more. Attack. Oh wait, so so it's like an overhead. Yeah. So it's like, so when, when that hook happens, and then, and then you, can, you can maybe like do more attacks afterwards. And then okay. his medium, try to hit medium after hook. That puts bleed on me. Even when I block, it doesn't even have to hit. So now that bleeds on me, you can start pulling and making me shift, right? And then that, that down is too. Yeah, that's, that's really good. This has an armor on it. So do it again. Like, how does that feel to be artifacted? People noticing that you're down S2. Good down S2. It's actually an interesting thing to know. Oh, okay, so you treat like a parry almost. Yeah, it's like get off of it. But if I block it, sorry. Down S2. Or I can throw you, you know. Yeah. Yeah. Also, like if I have like quick enough jabs, yeah. it's only one hit arm. Right, okay. So something like this, like Ari will help you beat it. But yeah, then after that you can do down down S2. Yeah. So you do the big down S2, down down S2. Oh, you yeah. Now enough. I'm bleeding, and now I'm in the corner, and we're not in a good time. So Derek, right. Derek's is a bad bully. Yeah. Okay. So you, can, you can actually do holes after that. So you can do down down S1 plus S2 to so try to hook. Yeah. Well, I'm going to parry for a second. <laughs> do a, yeah, do the S1 right, so, the throw. So S1 boom, throw. Down, down, yeah, yo, that's what's up. I that's see, okay. Let's go. And so Darius is pretty, he flipped by first glance, but you're yeah. like, I'm going to get that bleed. And then really get the party started, right? So does the bleed, do, let's say, let's say, uh, does bleed do like bonus damage if they don't block it? Like, it only does in the case of your S2. So, uh, so S2, if you can just stand there for a second, normally it sends you tumbling, right? See how you tumble? Yeah. And if you're close enough to the corner, you'll actually, uh, you'll actually like hit the corner and kind of slump into it. Okay. So you can, like do it from here. Sorry. Oh, come a little closer. So like right there's fine. So, like, see how you? Oh, oh yeah, the corner, like you're sitting in the corner. You, but like, uh, okay, that's cool. But if I do this, it does. You know, it's not that good, but it's because you're bleeding. So, so if I do it up close. Okay. 
You don't tumble. And so like, uh, so just block for a second. So now you're bleeding, block again. Yeah, I see that chip. It does a lot of shock, right? Yeah, like it does. So, so yeah, so there's a benefit there. You don't have to be perfect with the tip when you're bleeding. So like, uh, hit me with it, hit S2, S2. Also, you can hold forward S2 and do different variations. Okay. Do it again. Too close. And then just do it up close. Do, do S2, S2 right next to it. See how I still tumble and I'm still taking a lot of extra damage to tumble. Yeah. So yeah, that does do a little bit extra. He's oh, it is way more if you're back there. Okay, more, I see that. Okay. You down this one. And then you can like do S2, S2, down S2, you can do all kinds of stuff. Yeah, yeah, oh, you did, if you did uh, down on S1 or down on S1 plus S2, you would have got it. Okay. Try that again, that was sick. So, I hope, I hope, score one more. Down, pull. Pull, you can do that too. Uh, let me try this again. So, down, pull, and then I go forward. Oh, oh, cause it's oh double down. yeah, I, I didn't missed. show you double down stuff yet. Where's the double down? So let me show you something cool you could do with like a uh, RE variants, right? Okay. You can do like this. Oh, uh, uh, almost it. You can do like stuff like that, or yeah. say like I'm RE and I do something like this. Right now, you're the on the bleed, so. Yeah, and then you're, yeah, you're just getting freaking owned. Okay. So, let's say I go here, and then if I want to go here, see, I keep doing the wrong one. Oh, it takes like the game for sure. There you there go. go. Then you can do down on this one. And you can actually wait until the slam. Oh, yeah. Oh, yo, no, stop. That was sick. <laughs> that was almost going to be really, really cool. So that's just kind of like the, the fun of double down. Do you see how yeah. it's like way different than when you're using bolts, right? Right. Okay, so I'm trying to remember. This is, I mean, I haven't done this in forever, but it's like boom, 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 and then you launch, and then you jump, and then you keep going, right? Yeah, I usually just do jump heavy and jump S2. So do the launch, like get me into the air. Wait, what the heck? It's down forward heavy. So down heavy is like, yeah, down heavy is anti, down forward heavy is launcher. Boom, boom, boom. There you go. And just no direction in S2. Right. I actually kind of do this one. This is an easy one. This is the one I like to do. It's like, uh, I usually do like one, two, three, S2. You can just okay. do like one, two, three, launch, one, two, three, S2. Okay. So. Launch. Oh, whoops, I had team. My bad. Oh, it's okay. I think you want to get Darius back in. <laughs> I know which character is your favorite in this. Uh, yeah. Pull it back. There we go. Okay, so. Boom, 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 boom. Frick! Why do you keep doing that? I don't know why my, my brain keeps telling me to do that. Sorry, I just I literally just filled your brain with infinite info. Yeah, yeah it's really interesting too because you know we One, two, three. So boom, boom, boom. Why am I in trouble? Oh, you know. So boom, boom. Because Daifun was able to see a really, really early version of Halawi. Why am I doing this? So one thing that's interesting is down forward, uh, down forward medium is your sweep. Yeah. So it's like, there you go, there you go. That's what's up. That's what's up. Come on, so boom, 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 boom. There you go. There you go. This picture. Boom, boom. Bump, 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 bump. Oh, almost shout out to Chad. So, whenever you're in the air, do you go heavy, heavy, or heavy, heavy, just one heavy and then S2, S2? You can do whatever you want. I, I typically tend to do like, uh, like, if you jump right away, like, so you don't have to, I just literally, as I'm hitting down forward heavy, I just hold up forward. So you just so will automatically jump, right? And as soon as they jump, I just already start hitting buttons, like, medium, heavy, S2. Right. That's what I recommend. Okay, so. Just try launch. Just try down forward heavy. And yeah, once you jump, just do medium heavy S2. Oh, so no direction. Okay. That's when you get a direction. S2 in all these different directions, like twice. Yeah. 
Block it if I'm going if I'm back jumping in the air. Yeah, you can block so it. So you can block here. in the air. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Interesting. Okay. It, 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 like, so, so it just jumps straight up and just try to block. Oops. It's like when you think it's blocked, but jump again. I can throw you. I think you can break my throw with the same throwing play. What's that? What was throw again? Uh, it's medium and heavy. Okay. So you can do it in the air too. So if you just jump up and throw me. Yeah. So do it again. We break it. So there's like a lot of layers too. We, we have that. We don't want you just hold up back and jump and block forever, you know? Yeah. So I. Our winner. She's nasty. So that one's weird. Uh, she's got it down and heavy as a manual drop. Oh! Well, that oh. Was Let's go. Why do I keep doing that? Because you want to put the fleet on me. I know how you're doing it. It's my... Nice. Oh, nice. Frick! Oh. I did it again. <laughs> oh. Then down, down, that's one with Ari. Or down, down, that's two. It's cool because after that Darius one, after his down, down, that's one, they bounce after they hit the ground. So you can do an Ari super raptor. Right. So watch them bounce. You can do it at any time. I usually wait till they but, slam um, and then do uh, it. Uh, so that's, that's a good one. It's consistent. Look how much damage now I'm bleeding. That's not yeah. fair. Oh, it's a parry, though. <laughs> it's a parry so this is a parry, right? Parry. Yeah. yeah. They use the one meter, so I'm going to jump and then do a minute. You're right. We control the light direction. And then you can run up and hit me, and you get your meter back, too, if you're successful. Oh, okay. And you get a little bit extra on top of it. So okay. We, that, we want you to make bets. People are like, yo, I want to bet. I like to gamble. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, oh, yeah. If you want that, we got you. But it's a big risk. A meter is a lot when you only have three. Yeah. So when you, when you hit a parry, it's kind of hyped. You're like, oh, shit. I actually read you enough to do, to do this, you know? Right. Um, the really good question so parry in the air, is there, do you have parry in the air? Do it again. Oh, it looks like parry in the air is just, it's just, no a, yeah. it's just a heavy, right? Yeah, so there's parry on the ground, there's, there's low parry. So I'm going to jump and go low. Yeah. Right. When you low parry someone, it is the most insulting thing ever. So, so one. Like, that medium heavy, then hit S2. Yeah, uh, but just a little quicker, like hit them on the way up. Yeah. Oh, oh, almost, I, almost. We had it. Yeah. Boom, boom, boom. Oops. One, two, three. Ooh, nice. I threw, I threw a light in there. You know what to do after you land. Yeah, you give him one of these. And then you know what to do after that. You do a Ari super after that. Yeah, true. Oh. That's a bunch with it. Oh, and the bomb into the heart? I've never seen that. That's it. Okay. So you kind of see how you're like, okay, I'm like sucking through the team, but you're also sucking through how to use the fuse. And it's just going to play and look way different than an RE series that's using freestyle or something, right? Yeah, I know exactly. Did you just whip? I think I, I, think I did. Hold, while Ari is holding? Yeah. That's crazy. I, I feel like it's, it's just going to do like crazy damage. You're showing me stuff I've not seen before. <laughs> oh, you missed. Oh, I missed. I'm going to show you what this guy can do. Here's some harder ones. Very hard. Okay. Oh, you're pulling the air. Okay. Oh, I messed it up. 
those extremities like hands on the Damn, okay. But I messed it up, it wasn't real. Yeah, how, wait, how did you mess it up? Oh, uh, because you could have teched out. So like, watch this, oh, jump in here, and then hold life punch after I hit you. But after, only afterwards. See how you check? Oh. If you're ever getting combo, just hold life punch in back, forward, or no direction. And you'll automatically check out. So just hit me out of the air. See? But that was counter hit. Then I check out. Right, I see what you're saying. So like, that way if anybody's ever hit, you can just get out of jail. Okay. Yeah. Sick. There's a bunch of defensive systems too, like retreating guard that I showed you. There's also push block. So yeah, there's, that's kind of the basics. There's also like, I can save my friend, come in, use that green bar at the top. So yeah. if, hit, uh, if I'm comboing you, and you hit these two, then you can hit team and oh. Ari, keep it going. Right. But you see, it takes a while for the bar to recover. So right. you gotta really like, make sure you use it at the right time. Oh my god. Oh, and then that was the armor. Two after that. You can do it right away. Like, you can mash it the moment you see that. Yeah, and then do Ari, cancel the Ari. Like, you can do the double down and her, her down on that one. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh. I don't think that yeah, see, I need to do. We're going. We're going. We're going to shake some. Oh, I oh, I see. Did you try to parry me? That's disrespectful. Oh, I try to parry you. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, almost. Frick. Uh oh. Frick. Oh, it's still working. Save you. So. Okay. Uh, I tried to do a, I tried to bring in Darius and I actually screwed it up. Oh no. Oh, that's, that's kind of Oh, you can do Ari. Oh, you did it right away. Oh, no. I should have waited, yeah. Try to get it. I'll see you do it. Okay. Well, that's tech, by the way. Just tap it when there's nobody out. So just tap team. Just tap it. You can do it like the air combo we were practicing. You can do your other character come right. It's like a thing like an alley oop or like a set up spike. Yeah. Do the Ari. Do Ari. Yo, you did it like second try. Uh, That's good. Yeah. Do so. it There you go. I think I'm getting like a. I think I'm like mashing it too much. Yeah, man. Wait a second. There you go. There you go. Oh. Oh, it's coming back. It's coming back. Oh no, I knocked him off. I didn't mean to knock him off. <laughs> I was trying to, I was trying to have him get hit by it, and then I was gonna have him. Yeah, that would have been, that would be great on the way back. Yeah. Oh, nice. Oh my God, that's uh, That's not gonna work. Oh, it is. Okay. That's good coverage. Yeah, so you can kind of see how like, you're putting it together now. You're yeah, like, oh, yeah. I can try this, I can try this. That's really what we're hoping for, right? Right. And imagine like you trying this with another person on your team. Yeah. Yeah. Trying to, like, coordinate yeah, coordinate it. it. Yeah, I think that's sick. We, we, we get into like these things like when we're playing with people, it's like, why didn't you save me? Why didn't you break the combo? Break the combo. Yeah. Yeah. And it's actually just hilarious. So, like, yeah. Dude. But, like, have you ever seen that movie, uh, Pacific Rim? With the Mexican yeah, years, years, like, years ago. I remember, yeah, I remember so, like, it. They had this thing in that movie where it's like, you want to and humans to pilot it, and they're drip compatible. They're, like, synced, right? Yeah. We, I'm talking about it because, like, in our games, there's a moment when you're playing with someone that you hit that drip compatibility, and you know exactly what your teammate's going to do, and it feels amazing. Yeah. It actually feels amazing. And when we first experienced it, we felt like we were on something special. Like, oh, Right. Fighting games can really be fun with another player, you know. Right. So, but it's hard, you know. It's not easy, and we're we're still learning. So. Yeah.
Yeah. No, I think I think it's it's super fun so far. Like, uh, yeah, I'm uh, I'm excited. I'm very very excited. Do you know? Do you have any idea, like, roughly how many champions you guys want to launch with? Yes, uh, but we haven't. Uh, uh, okay, okay, okay. That's uh, fine. I could say that, like, uh, you know. <laughs> there will be more. <laughs> so, like, everybody always says we want as many champions as possible. I think for us, uh, we do as well. But there's, like, a limit, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think, though, more than, like, having a, a ridiculous amount on launch, we want to make sure that we're consistently, like, releasing new champions that feels fresh, you know? Like, yeah. It's not feeling, like, too long in between the next champion release. Right. Makes sense. That's kind of what we're going for. Sorry for the non-answer. No, 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 no. I mean, it's a non-answer, but, like... It's not a non-answer. I feel like if you understand like how games work, it's not really a non-answer. Because like, the, if you have too many champions, just realistically, the game becomes a nightmare to balance. Yeah, I'm excited. I'll show you a little advanced stuff in the corner with Darius. Let me show you one. Uh -huh. This might look kind of cool. Let's see. Okay. Oh, bad. It's kind of hard. Dude, that's so much damage. That's crazy. Hey, you just juggle it. That's so much damage, and then you're done. That's insane. 28 hits. But yeah, it's, uh, you know, I, that means I have to land this jump hold heavy to start it. So, you know, it's hard. It's usually anti or something. Yeah. That's just like an example. Like, it's, it's, it takes a little bit of time to get it down, but just like, even if you can't do it, like, stuff like this is just, like, really fun. You know, like, yeah. I'm gonna do this. So, we continue to kind of get down and do this. You know, just, that's, that's nice. Yeah. Like, I, well, the thing I like a lot is, like, uh, like the tactility, right? Like oh, when I when I send that, like I feel like I'm swinging an axe. Hell yeah. Yeah, like I, I can like feel it hit, which is good. Yeah, it's actually crazy. Like our, our all of our creatives, like our our designers, our especially our animators, our VFX artists. You know, they love these characters. Like, like yeah. I don't think folks really understand like like Mike, the, the animator that worked on Gary at all. He loves. Gary. He wants to make these things feel super heavy. Yeah. Gary back throw. Let me show you how much he loves his character. He doesn't stick that in you. He sticks in the ground and drags, and drags you. It's like brutal. Yeah, puts it right behind you? Yeah. yeah it's like so, brutal. It's so, so good. That's just like, he's like, yo, what if we did this? And I'm like, hell yeah, let's try it. So it's, yeah. it's that kind of energy with everyone that, you know, everybody's working on all these champs that I think it's like kind of to your point is making it feel like, oh, this feels heavy. This feels impactful. Oh, you like that? No, it's not. <laughs> It's sick, it's so sick. Chad, what'd you guys think? Yo, thanks everybody. What's up, dudes? Thanks so much, appreciate it. Come give our game a try whenever you get a chance. Sign up for Alpha Lab. Thanks. Yo, what's up? My name is S Man. And uh, I play video games. what do you think of 2XKO? 2XKO so far has been sick. Uh, I I played it last year for the first time. I got to stop by Riot a couple months ago, and uh, I got to play then. Not the same build that is here in Evo, which has Braum, so, so we didn't know about Braum. But, uh, but yeah, I got to play it a little bit earlier, got to play it here. I uh, saw that Ari got updated. I think Ari got updated, right? like, what they did was good, because they, uh, they made her a little bit easier to use. She had kind of like a charge, like she had to recharge her special before, which is kind of tedious, but they got rid of that, which is cool. Uh, Braum is super sick, very funny, like, he's got a lot of character to him, and I think, like, if you play League, and, and one of the coolest things about it is when you play League, like, you see, like, a lot of the references to the different abilities and whatnot, uh, particularly with Braum and with Darius, actually with everybody, to be honest, that's just who I've played a lot of, but yeah, so, super cool. Favorite person to play so far, um, so, my champion, I have a Kale one trick, it's not in the game. But um, Darius has been really fun. Rom might end up being my favorite. Uh, Ari is really fun as well. Uh, I have a personal uh, I have a personal beef with the Lowy from beating me in lane so many times, so I don't know if I can bring myself to, to play as Lowy. Uh, but Lowy is all I mean they're all good, but those are the three. I would say I would say Darius, Rom, Ari are my three favorite. Uh, 
How was trying Brom's kit for the first time? You know, how did you feel? Uh, I like Brom's kit because you can really feel the, the weight of the shield as a weapon, but I'm also, like, he has a lot of, like, utility and defensive stuff, and, um, like, how he, like, advances the shield, it's almost like a riot shield, like, SWAT team going in, you can bash people. Um, funny character, like, a lot of the moves have, like, uh, I like, like the, the he has like a one arm push up. Or like, I think it's like a one finger push up. Then he turns around and he does like a, a chest press on him. So it's pretty fun. I, li I like Brom's kid a lot because it felt you can feel the weight of the abilities, uh, but it also was smooth at the same time. Uh, and I like I said, I, I really like the character that uh, Brom kind of brought. Okay, your favorite part about Let's talk about it in two ways. One, from a gameplay standpoint. The game feels really smooth. You kind of feel like the riot quality. So you have the smoothness. I feel like I'm getting better at it whenever I'm playing. I feel like I'm learning things. So it's like, oh, okay, here's this, this, this. It also wasn't too hard to get into. Uh, most of my fighting game experience has been on Street Fighter. And this is a very different type of game. Uh, it's a little bit more of like a modern control set. Because you've got your light, medium, heavy, and then special one, special two. Uh, and then you're like tag your team, your team spot button. Uh, and you have parry your dash too. But it's different than the Street Fighter light, medium, heavy punch, light, medium, heavy kick, and kind of going from that sort of gameplay. Um, but it's smooth, it's easy to, to kind of get like acclimated to. Other side of it, I like the art style, I like the fact that it's in the League universe. So like, I, I started playing League Season 2, uh, I played on and off for years, but uh, I really like the League characters. One of the big things with the League universe, and kind of taking those characters and putting them in a fighting game, it gives you an opportunity to expand on what those characters are, and it really like, almost builds up the lore of those characters in a different way. Like, Ori is a mage, right? She's like, a, she's like an assassin-ish mage. But she's, she's a mage of high mobility. But in this, like, what is Ori the character? Like, the character dog archetype is like, she's a fox, right? So she goes in, she has a lot of quick attacks, the claws, all that. I think it's cool that they're able to go and take these characters. They actually fit in really well from a uh, character, like, archetype standpoint, building design off of that. So, that's what I was really impressed with. Uh, anything you want to say to the devs? Uh, good job, devs. <laughs> anything to say to the devs? Good job, devs. It's fun. It's super fun so far. I'm really enjoying it. So can't wait to see more. Yeah, thanks. You too. Hi, right, chat. Thank you so much for joining me today. Super fun. Evo's great. I was successful on the Evo match winner. So I went one and two. I was very happy with that. Everything is SFAN TV. YouTube, Instagram, Discord, Reddit, Twitch, Twitter. Everything is SFAN TV except for two new YouTube channels, SFAN Daily and Coach S Fan, two new YouTube channels. Check those YouTube channels out. I'm trying to get them to a thousand subs. So thanks for watching, guys. Bye, everybody.